Now, Peichel has talked a lot about depth. That's Tyler Whitney, Sydney projected at the rim. Hyatt met him at the summit. More smart on defense is that last block rejection the other calls the rack a special place it's a great moment for him to be able to coach and bring the warriors here another backdoor look as jensen could not finish the layup good pass from jordan minor and the other way getting the roll baker swinging high a contested three that goes it's only the second team foul you take a look at that three a moment ago by Andre Hyatt. His career up beautifully. Nine points, a career high for Jones. They've all been significant. And now the steal. Hyatt. And it circles back around. Good cross by Coleman. No look feed, but blocked from behind. Hyatt was there. Wow. Five points. Another angle at it. See Hyatt, clean trail, all ball right there. By the way, the foul before the break, not called a shooting foul. And as you can see, it's NJIT with the ball, trying to get O'Hearn back at it. Andre Hyatt drives it back to the Bronx. Time you stay at the Marriott. You know what? <laughs> I'm staying at the Hyatt with Andre. <laughs> Here's C.J. Fulton hold up, and Harper Jr. snatches it away. Rutgers looking to run. Hyatt in transition, got hit. Good, Dom. Let's take another look at this again. Hyatt may have gotten away with an extra step there, but he was being fouled. Shot clock at 7, downstairs for Amorier. More facilitation. Hyatt has to hoist and hits. Baker on the drive. Swings it to the corner. Andre Hyatt's first touch of the game. He'll pivot. Put one up in the lane and get it to roll. It's another to take impossible shots, and you just can't do that in a game like this. And you can't, there's no gimmies in the Big Ten, all right? Right. But if you look at those first five games, with a nice drive, patient play there from Andre Hyatt. Core players for Central Connecticut who would have to step into a bigger role today with a couple of their starting bigs out. Get a look at two zone offenses here against zone defense. Now we'll see if uh, nice turnaround. Okay, he fires away from three. Tapped out to Ron Harper Jr. Second opportunity good. It's just a killer because you get Paul Mulcahy. He... Hyatt back on the floor for Rutgers. Good first half. Driving, knocks it in. Just crossing over on the freshman. Look at the contact here. Gets the bump, stays on balance. By Kobe Bufkin. Starting to come on for Michigan. That's a tough guard for him because Andre Hyatt wants to get to the rack. This is Andre Hyatt from the free throw line with the jumper. Two feet in the paint, elevate over the shorter defender, bucket. That's not the way you want to approach the game. There's Harper, 10 on the shot clock for Rutgers. Hyatt, another three, turn it, and a foul. Hyatt, the sophomore, like the foul. Well, the double team on Ron Harper Jr., unselfishness. Mag trying to post up Lowy. In the paint, got Thompson up, great leave, Hyatt up and up. So you talk about vision. This play was dead in the water. Three guys on you. How did he get that through? Pump fake and power. That is Rutgers offense. Grinds you. Collapse the defense. Kicks it off. Six to play in the half. Here's Hyatt. He'll fade away outside the lane. Andre Hyatt with the final bucket of this entertaining first half. Five on the timer. Hyatt hesitates, staggers, and Amori slams it down. I don't know if it was intended, but it certainly was effective. And Dami, just watch this again. Hyatt setting up Amori. Three to shoot here, and it's stolen away. Rutgers has another one. Mag ahead for Hyatt, who's all alone. Now the Jersey Mike's Arena faithful into it, undoubtedly. Dunks from Amori, 
And now since then they've outscored them 27 to 4. So Rutgers is putting on a clinic. Oh, up for Hyatt. He got it anyway. Print the poster. That was something. Cliff Amori. Mag got a toe on the line, but look at that lob to Hyatt getting up there, way up there. This is a great camera for it. And man, that was an incredible pass. And that's the second lob we've seen from Simpson. Now sometimes you're in a zone as a player, and it seems like on both sides, Cam Spencer is. And now Hyatt picks it off. It's the Rutgers defense feeding the offense. They've collected five steals. And the defense feeding the offense as the Scarlet Knights are running early. I have the wrap around. Above the rim one more time. I thought Hyatt was going to go up for the shot, but instead a sweet wrap around and finish. Mori has been the, the biggest bright spot. Much increased in the second 16 minutes. A lot of contact, blocking foul. Count the basket. But in the last couple days, I've seen nothing but flops and... Eight and a half to go in the opening half. Scarlet Knights up by 10, and Hyatt stole it away. He's got Simpson, two on one. Oh, yeah. oh my goodness! Oh, oh. Oh, my God. He went flying over Mervyn James. And coming contagious. Guys being gap strong. Andre Hyde in the right position. I saw this coming. Once you give that up, you can expect it back on his head. Rips it out of there. And after three chances, the fast break. Up and under for Andre Hyatt. Just picked up that technical foul, Dom, just a moment ago. Here's a turnover. And it's Scandalbury ahead of everybody, but Hyatt blocked it away. No thanks. Well, the second that you think you have a little bit of momentum, Andre Hyatt comes in from behind and says, no, sir. And now Hyatt nearly has the steal. And Wolfolk comes up with a deflection. Lobs it ahead. Hyatt for Simpson. There's your highlight, young man. But what man? arcing triple off the mark. But look at McConnell grabbing the rebound. On the reload. Andre Hyatt ties the game. This is their first true conference test, obviously, with it being the opener here for these two teams in Big Ten play. Shot clock dwindling. Using the spin. Andre Hyatt off the glass. With a reverse pivot. Just a beautiful shot fake. Former teammate of Andre Curbelo. Former fighting Illini. Spencer the takeaway. Hyatt on the run out with the easy two. With the emotional lift that Rutgers experienced early in this game. You know, but emotion only lasts you for so long in a game. You know, everybody's settled in right now. That'll give you a lift, though. Yeah, something around the rim like this would have looked like. I'm not sure, man. That's pure athleticism right there. Excellent pass. That last defensive sequence by Rutgers was a good one as they forced a long shot, didn't allow the ball to get inside the paint. Hyatt banked it in. First of all, Hyatt with the bank shot. Once you put one in the bank, Clinton had stripped away. Mag into the front court. McConnell puts it back. They turned it over left and right in the first five minutes, and I think that concern's been there the entire day. Oh, absolutely. And you know, you come into a place like this with this kind of crowd, made it competitive, but the pressure just wore them down. Should get in the gaps. They're handsy and clingy. Spencer with the steal, tipped it to Amoy. Rutgers on the fast break. There's a dunk for Andre Hyatt on the alley -oop. Right here, Rutgers turns defense to offense on a run out and a big time finish at the other end. That might have woken up the Rutgers defense too. Mulcahy intercepts one. Up top, Hyatt brings it down. 
It is a highlight show here in the Jersey Mike Arena tonight on both ends. Good finish. And now it's Maryland with a four on one. Hart cannot finish. Simpson leaks out. Slams it home. And Kevin Willard wants another timeout. Have a good feeling about it. Turns completely the opposite direction. Well, they were crashing the boards, but another turnover leads to a run out. Great action back and forth. What a block. No one gets back. And this place is going nuts. Rutgers. Doesn't get enough love nationally. Steve Fike. He built this program the right way. Well, and he built it on that. He yes. built it on defense. Yes. Now, if you close out too strong, he can pull it back and put it on the deck. That makes it so difficult to defend. Ooh. Ooh. That's tough, too. That's a bit of deer face material right there. That was pretty. And then the next possession, this was Andre Hyatt. And this is Walter Davis. A little gamesmanship, a little friendship. Great job. Got a guy that didn't start off quickly, but man, they get a bucket inside. This could get, this could open up. High it again. Ooh. It's his second half. All 10 of his points here in the second stanza. And Rutgers has its largest lead of the night. Well, you're conscious right now, not even thinking about it. Hold the follow through, Andre Hyatt. Now Penn State about to have a season low in points. Had scored 58 in every game. Hyatt not challenged. And it is a dominant effort tonight on the home floor. Ooh. Murray now up to 24 points. Hyatt will throw up a three and hit it. Andre Hyatt has had a phenomenal second half here, 16 points. There's so many teams that take so many threes, recognizing they can't shoot it. Instead of putting pressure on the defenses, going into the paint, foul. But Rutgers doesn't miss a beat right there. Some pretty good hustle, an excellent pass and follow by Andre Hyatt. Just utilize. And yet you're on pace for as good or better a season as you had a year ago. Pretty impressive is Hyatt. It's the two-hand flush. It's now a 30-point game. Really good execution by the Atlanta. 32% on the season from three. Hyatt on the drive. Hyatt able to finish. That was beautiful. Hyatt goes full speed. That's where Hyatt's got to be shot ready. He had eight of Rutgers' first ten. Great find underneath to McConnell. Hyatt to work his way down, and he gets the first two of the game. Great pick of the Washington Wizards. Hyatt hanging in the air. What a tough shot. Same play as the last time. Good job by Chucky Hepburn blowing it up. Simpson on the move. Simpson can't hit. Tipped in by Hyatt. I thought on first glimpse it was outside of the cylinder. That's ugh. And he can feel that physically, oh, right? Oh, big time. Chatter the help. Oh, Maury the flush. Here on Sunday, Rutgers wraps up their regular season slate. It will be a defensive battle for the ages against Northwestern. As Hyatt, speaking of defense, he gets it done on offense here with an and one opportunity coming up. Ends up in a downhill drive by Hyatt. What's your strategy here as you try and chip away at it if you're Steve Peichel? You got to get the ball inside as much as possible. They've gotten really good stuff. They're listening. Coach does a good job of rim rumming to the basket to get the open layup, and the help side is not there. And yeah, Wolfolk off to a great start shooting the ball, especially when they're from point blank range. He's made four out of five shots.
Hyatt on the back down. And one! Down low, and then Hyatt, the strong body into the chest of Latimer. You mentioned the atmosphere so conducive to mental errors. Look at this, another one. It's worth the timeout. Stymie you a little, slow you down. Good old Bella. Oh, goodness. Another turnover. Number eight. Bombra forced it. Look out, Hyatt. Got it. Wow. Oh. It was quick. Yeah. Nobody posting, nobody in position to step to the... They have to be ready, I should say. They can't take anything for granted. Mm -hmm. And a really good TCU team yeah. coming in. Big East, big 12 Look at challenge. This. Here's Griffiths. He closed the first half with a dunk like that. Hey, Griffiths. Rising. High. Well, it was just a terrific... McVagor. No, and he stumbles. Hyatt has his step, and Hyatt flushes it down. The outlet pass, getting it out quick, one dribble and going up. They can fill up the stat sheet from the three-point line, and you see them letting them fly right now. Now Fernandes getting down to defend. It's a turnover. Hyatt ahead of the pack. Reed still searching. Can't get it there. It's an air ball from five feet. Hyatt in stride. Yes, sir! The guy's been playing a long time. He knows that's way too open. Switch for Griffiths. Here's Clark. Probing, and Hyatt sent it home. It's this season. Yeah, and Rutgers has made things miserable on St. Peter's. A week or two ago, we were practicing with less than 10 guys. Didn't have 10 people who were available. Oh, Maury inside. Ruthless on the rim. Look how hard Jermichael Davis will see after this dunk from Maury. Yeah, nice pass there. And you said it. He's been having a little bit of the touch all game. But we know he can still dunk the basketball. Did not play a ton in the first half with foul trouble. Could not finish at the rim. And that's one of the big stories in the second half. Can LIU stay out of foul trouble? And Rutgers now with a 12-point lead and a little more than five minutes to go. Hyatt lobs, and Amori jams it. That was sweet. <laughs> oh, my God. Cleared for takeoff. Wow. Man, pinpoint pass right there. That was seven. Hubbard's got to go. And Hyatt ripped it out of his hands. Three for Hyatt. Beats the buzzer. And hits it. The steal and the triple down the half. That threw a momentum booster to the locker room. Well, he's welcoming that challenge against Josh Hubbard. That is a timely poke away. And talk about walking down on your op right there. Stepping into it. Big Cinco's ready for the moment. Big time three here in, Big, in Brick City. Half time here in Newark. And of course it was a defensive play. To Ali, you play. Matthews had earlier this season. That is a big time athletic play on his backside. It is fouled. Because he's done that twice, and he's made to pay both times. And I was also done a nice job of finding opportunities to score at the rim, none bigger than that. On the turnover. Coming back from the injury last year, and then missing the games through the middle portion of the non-conference slate. He said he was trying to do too much when he returned. And there's a three-ball for Andre Hyatt. Well, Rutgers trying to find the range from long range, and starting to find it. Nice job utilizing Cliff Amore. Hyatt from long range. Hyatt with the shake, tough shot, hit, no foul. And Rice had it poked out of there. Mag tried to leave it for Wolfolk. Simpson found it. Hyatt the pinball, and it's a three. It's good defense, a lot of physicality. You come up with the steal, and these are big time shots from the wing. Hyatt, great find, Williams, an open three. Tried to attack everyone who's guarding them early in the shot clock. Look, ball fake, dribble penetration. Good job by hanging in there by Jermichael Davis. Freshman getting put in that post, and he hung in. And then driving it, side bucket, and the foul, Andre Hyatt, trying to ignite his offense. Double figures, 14 a game. He shot it pretty well from three, gets bumped by Ty Rogers. And now an opportunity for Hyatt for three here at the line. 
Get it to the left side here. There's a shot waiting for Rutgers, but it's a little too late. High and a quick burst. Hello! Big time! High! Roberta Flack killing it softly. You want to get the basketball to the opposite side of the floor as quickly as you can because everyone loads up to the basketball and you can get some one-on-one -on -one opportunities. And that's exactly what happened with Andre Hyatt there, able to reverse that basketball up and in. They had executed that a couple of times. <laughs> Those Cliff Amori dunks, they just get this Rutgers team so energized. The disc gets the defender right here, the duck in, get Reese on the hip, easy delivery. And a smart play by Reese. Last game, he got into foul trouble because giving the foul on. Isaac Hyatt way off the mark there, and now back comes Harris Smith looking for Kaiser in the corner. Ops to drive and still shoot. What a rejection there. But coming right at you. Kaiser thinks he has an easy one, and Mori says, not on my watch. Maybe a shove on Omori, and he left that short. And the rebound to Simpson. Cliff wanted the lob, instead it's Hyatt on the attack and scores off the window. <laughs> you know what I mean? Folks will get a grip machine. Do some fingertip push ups. Get your hands strong. Hyatt off the curl for three, knocked it down. Over here in this first half. Bole, man, what a screen. You see great guards screaming for an offensive foul on the screen. Let's take another look. He moved a little bit, that's for sure. Now leads his team in scoring. He has 15 points. Store still stuck on 14. The lob, low! And Cliff pretty good on that end as well. And then tried to fit. That's a 10 second. Ooh, they almost got a 10 second count. Credited with the basket a moment ago is Hyatt. Simpson on the drive, the kick out, Hyatt with the answer! And now Simpson drives and attacks. As he was thinking to play ahead to try to lob it up toward the rim. Hyatt finds a cutting wolf for it. easy two. That's how you spread the floor. Or those floaters, which over the last couple of games might have had a clear path, they've all been contested. Hyatt with an awkward shot, somehow it goes in. <laughs> How did that happen? She complete Hawkins knows it, but I mean Hyatt right here, kind of going to the ground, had to get, flip it up there, and then watch at the end. See, that was probably. I don't know. He just gave up 20 to Robbie Hummel. He kept saying buckets to me. Weird. <laughs> Anything hurts when you give up 20. Intercepted by Hyatt, and he scores. And there's the turnover once again. Clean block with his offhand, without fouling. That's good defense. A beautiful inbounds play, and Hyatt with the easiest two he'll get all day. Now Rutgers shoots less than 40 percent from the field, and that is in the bottom five of all Division One teams. But you wouldn't know it right now. Back to man to man too with a little switching and double teaming outside. There's a deflection and off they go again. Simpson a flag. Oh my goodness! Jeremiah Williams with a shot clock dwindling. That is a tough attempt right to his buddy Andre Hyatt. Amori, yes, and a foul against Williams. Catches it and he's underneath the basket. Again, here's the delivery, but watch how quickly he goes up, knowing the defender's on his back and can't do much about it. Wow. That was quick, and McDaniel cannot hit it. The other way, nobody's got it right high. <laughs> Pass of the ball, not like that. I never knew what to do when I never had this problem. <laughs> wow, I wish I did. And he goes right into the locker room. Another turnover for Wisconsin. But that is just huge, literally and figuratively. I mean, Amori means so much to this team. 11 points, 9 rebounds a game. Ole rolled. Simpson found Williams. Hyatt takes the three. And finally knocks one in. Ball movement, body movement for Rutgers. Andre Hyatt drills a three from the top. Yeah, I'm guessing that you bring you bring three if you're really in there. We'll see what happens in this final 10-50. And oh, nice drive and finish plus the foul for Andre Hyatt, a chance for three. No surprise to see Jameer Young checking back in. Maryland a little bit lackadaisical coming out of the timeout. They throw it away.